Eleven right here playing Cadillac Props. We're still working on the harvesting yet here on this episode. We're well, maybe third of the field left here, so not a whole lot left to go here. We should be uh, finished with this field here. No problem here this episode. So yeah, be uh, harvesting here for a little bit. And then uh, remind me, of what we need to go and uh, fire the hired worker. Now, nothing you know, personal against the hired worker here, nothing. But uh, we don't want her costing us money here over the winter months here actually speaking of winter months i'm gonna do like can we plant the crops again in this harvest i have no idea what i'm tempted maybe we should not like uh just like plant a strip on one of the fields just to see what's what happens i have no idea what that'd be <laughs> they're rather interesting if you ask me if that would work also see once if this uh, field will need anything or not not sure when we're done so actually we might want to actually keep the hired worker for just a little bit see once if we need any field work done although i guess we can do it next spring as well doesn't really super matter uh, as I said before, I'm still not entirely sure how the whole seasons, because again, I mean, there is a date up top there. We're currently September 11, September 11 here, harvesting the rye. I'm not sure how much that uh, really plays into the game here, because you know, again, I'm going to double crop the rye here, essentially. I don't know, is that a thing in real life? I don't know if it is or not, but... I'm going to assume probably for the most part not. I know in uh, real life, everyone, sometimes there will be, uh, like, double crops, for example. Well, we say double crops. I don't know if that's even true double crops. You know, for example, everyone will plant winter wheat. Once the winter wheat is harvested, usually July or so. And then sometimes, well, June, July, somewhere in there, right? Depending on what part of the country you're in. Sometimes soybeans can be planted after that. Sometimes even corn. Uh, uh, farmers are really pushing it, but usually not. Usually it's, like, soybeans or something like that, right? And that'll be uh, essentially a double crop. You got the uh, wheat, and then you got the uh, soybeans later that fall. Okay, we're almost full here. We're going to make it to the end. No, uh, not, probably not quite. Not quite. Well, actually, we might make it to the end here. It's going to be close. Trailer's are currently about half full here at the moment. Oh, hey, look at that. We made it all the way in. Nice. Nice. Turn this uh, boat around here. Harvest just a little bit more and we'll be full. Uh, literally a little bit more. Yep. What did I say, Evan? Just a little bit more. Okay. Then we'll go grab the unloading tractor, which still looks like it's full, by the way. Apparently, Evan, the uh, fill plane in this is uh, glitched out here at the moment. <laughs> Oops, no idea. Might just be able to finish harvesting the rest of this field here. Maybe. We'll see once. Alright. Yeah, that's one thing I don't particularly care for. That one is the uh, third person view of the main character. Uh, I don't know. Again, some people might like that. Everyone, my personal preference, I'm going to say no. I, I don't really care for that. Oh, hey, look, look at that. Looks like it fixed the, uh, get the... There we go. Get the camera to work with me there. Yeah, the fill plane fixed itself. Cool. Our hammer trailer. Trying to get the view there. Okay, apparently the camera, we need, uh, was it the no collision camera mod like we have for farming simulator, apparently. Oh, that's right, I gotta stay in the combine for keep on going. I forgot about that. My bad. Getting back in. Fine. Be that way. Once this is uh, done, the low number one will go throw a... Not really, I don't know, what would you call it? Hired worker, auto drive, driver, essentially to uh, take this down to the cell point. So it's not, I don't know, not really a hired worker per se, I guess, but let's see, our nearest road right up there. Yeah, we'll just be by the road and you should be able to take it from there. Fine, let's go. And go. Go. There we go. Must be a little heavy or something. I don't know. Anyway, let's Park it right there. Open up the map here. We need to go there. And if push N, he should just automatically uh, drive down. Then we'll hop out. We'll probably have to. We'll, we'll see once. Depending on where he lines up, and he might sell it for us. If not, we'll go ahead and uh, sell it once he's down there. 
And I'll probably have him drive back here as well. While he's doing that, we'll keep on harvesting. Activate cruise control. Well, I'll say again, I'm uh, so far uh, playing this game, rather enjoying it here. Of the other farming games that are out there, everyone, and I'm going to say other farming games, uh, other than farming simulator, everyone, this definitely feels like one of the better ones, if you ask me. So if you're going to you know, try a farming simulator other than farming simulator by Giants, this might be a good one to uh, check out here, if you ask me, everyone. Like I said, definitely rather enjoying it. And, uh, I mean, for those of you who really want to Get some uh, deep diving into field mechanics. I mean, help yourself. Oh my goodness, there's <laughs> lots of stuff there, everyone. Lots and lots of stuff there. Have fun with it. And yet, for maybe those of you who maybe don't want to go that deep into it, uh, there's some settings in the options there. You can turn them on and off, and you shouldn't have to worry about any of that uh, any of that stuff. Uh, for most part, everyone, I think we got most of the realistic settings turned on for the most part. After maybe uh, maybe we should go check that again, just see what sort of other settings we have. But we're looking up, uh, looking pretty good. Oh, I think we definitely uh, finished this. Oh yeah, should have no problem finishing that. Just a little bit here yet. In fact, one more pass should about do it. We'll have to get the uh, tractor headed back this way to unload the last little bit that's in the combine. We'll uh, sell that. We're currently sitting at forty-nine thousand dollars, so we actually made some money here this season. It feels like. We really haven't bought a whole lot other than, uh, you know, seed, fertilizer. And we did buy a plow. Uh, we did do that. That was about it, though. Probably have to swing past the, oh, uh, whatever the name of the place where we buy seed. Is again, pick up some more seed here next to spring. So, yeah, once we're done with this, we'll probably go ahead and uh, sleep through the uh, fall, winter here. Unless we want to try planting some crops. I guess we could try planting some crops. Okay, I'm going to back up real quick. I'm going to get this last little bit. Uh, it's hardly worth getting as well. Okay, fine. Harvest it backwards. Amazing how that works, isn't it, everyone? Surprised everyone that they would actually allow that to uh, work in the game here. Harvesting backwards. Okay, there we go. We are done harvesting. That uh, pipe put back out here, and like I said, once the uh, tractor, uh, tractor's probably not there yet. I don't think, is it? Let me go check. Be a little quick, I would think, if it is. Vehicle stuck. Oh, okay. Can I like? Guess I can close that. XP, 0.5 acres harvest. Okay, cool. Not not entirely sure. Like, what do we do with the XP? I have no idea. Vehicle is stuck. Hmm. Okay, cool. I, I just looking through this. I've actually, to be honest, I've never really looked at this before. So, yeah. Well, anyway, I guess we better go. Actually, let's go shut this combine off here a minute. Turn engine off. There we go. Okay, where's... Oh, he's not really stuck that bad. He's not stuck at all. He just cannot get to uh, where he wants to get to, I think. <laughs> Apparently, the, uh, yeah, it's on top of the shed or something stupid like that. Oh, look, I have a light bulb. Oh, I guess we can drive through the light bulb. Okay, cool. Apparently, I was still on driving yet. Uh, yep, get rid of that. There we go. Okay, then we're going to go back to the farm. Once we're done selling, of course. But once we sell that, that'll give us $11,347, if I understand that correctly. I take it we're empty, right? Oh, 
Okay, you just uh, drive back to the farm if you don't mind. And in the meantime, I'm going to take care of this tractor here. Then uh, put our plow away. Unless we want to plow that field. I'm not sure I'm Maybe we should. Take a look at the uh, field stats here in just a moment. There we go. Okay. Got that uh, parked up. Yeah, let's go check the field. Uh, that's not the field information. There we go. That's the field information I was looking for. So own field 14. Oh, yeah. We're way high in nitrogen and <laughs> uh, phosphate. We're out of the park on. Potassium, quite high on. Looks like the rest of this lower soil density is only 29%. A little low on that. Uh, but that's the field we plowed, too, isn't it? So did we go the wrong way? I don't know. Plowed is 100%. I would assume plowing... Uh, I'm, is plowing, like, raise this number or lower this number? I guess I should have paid closer attention to that. What is field 22 looking like? Field 22 here. Oh, so we have no crumbliness or crumb density. That's interesting. This one... Yeah, this one shows uh, that. I wonder why. Huh, I don't know. Uh, anyway, lower soil is 56%. Upper soil density is 38%. Well, it's still in the green yet, everyone. So that seems like that's uh, pretty good, if you ask me. I don't think we need to uh, change that then. We got 74% low clay loam. Medium clay loam. Clay -y. Uh, silty loam and seeded. Expected yield. What was that? Oh. Cat? I think it's a cat. That's a, that's a loud cat from here. Okay, now, did I see a tractor? I think I seen a tractor pulling in here. Yep. Yeah, we'll just tab to it. Okay, there we go. See, sappy. $60,000. Not too shabby, if you ask me. Not too shabby. Let's go ahead and unload the combine here, then. I don't know if we need to have the combine on for this. Apparently not. Have to be in the combine, I'm gonna, but don't have to have the combine on. Uh, how do you like that? Uh, how do you like that? That's pretty good. Uh, anyway, a reminder, everyone, if you haven't uh, done so already, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up there. Always very much appreciated. And, of course, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you do that there as well. And turn on the uh, bell notification. Once you are subscribed, that way you get notified when the latest, greatest RDL and video goes live. And uh, again, I mean, hopefully folks are enjoying the Cattle and Crops series here so far. Like I said, rather than enjoying the game. Needs more content, everyone, but what is here seems to be uh, seems to be quite solid, if you ask me. Yay. And then, I don't know, do we want to drive down there ourselves or have the, I don't know, do you call it hired worker auto, essentially autopilot, right? Do you want to have autopilot drive down there, or should we do it ourselves? I don't know. Guess we can probably do it ourselves. Is there anything else we need to do at the moment? Other than stare at a map and figure out how we want to deal with the fields. We can go fire a hired worker, I guess. Thinking of it for the fun of it, we might just end up plowing field 22 there. Uh, mind you, that it's probably going to take uh, an eternity to plow that field here. I think it was like a two meter plow we have or something like that ridiculously small. That'll definitely be a hired worker job. Definitely a hired worker job there. I think we just ran over a rabbit. Oh well. Well, it seems like this uh, game can handle some pretty uh, sharp turns without uh, too much trouble. Took that one uh, pretty hot there, if you ask me.
Whoa. Yep. Yeah. I might have uh, might have crashed into that slightly. I think that might be the one thing we still have turned off yet. Everyone is uh, vehicle damage. Probably better keep it that way. Just saying. Just saying. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, start that here. Let that unload. By the way, again, I'm going to bring up the mouse pointer. It is control on the keyboard. Push down control on the keyboard, and you get your mouse pointer. Open close door. Yeah, disconnect. Probably don't want to do that right at the moment while we're unloading. That'll be another $3,120. Not a whole lot of money there, but hey, we'll take it. We'll take it. Okay, I might at the very least have, have auto pilot drive the tractor back here. Let's get a waypoint set. Okay, there we go. And he should be good to go once he's back to the farm here. Oh, debate now. Should we like try just planting a little strip on there? We're just fast. I'm thinking we should probably fast forward some time here. We got pressure washer if we want to clean our vehicles. Nah, who'd want to do that? Hey, chicken. So yeah, there's our plowed field. Now, do we have to go back to the field information here real quick? Come on, everyone. Uh, do we have to? There's no cultivated section of this. Just plowed. Okay. Just checking out if we had to, like, cultivate the field before I planted it. Not that I can tell from what it's showing in the menu there. So, we'll probably just end up uh, going and plant it here. So, that, let's go uh, run inside here, everyone. We're going to maybe uh, sleep through the night. Actually, before we sleep, everyone, need to make sure we ditch the hired worker. Oh, uh, is that hired worker? I mean, nothing against the hired worker, but staff. Uh, shame, because she's actually got a fairly decent rating now. Dismiss. Yeah, one year and five months. And it basically costing us two thousand dollars a month there, everyone. So, you know, if we skip a couple of months here, it can be another ten grand. So yeah. Oh well. Oh, we actually got cheaper ones here too yet. Oh, we can actually rehire if we wanted to. Did not actually realize that one. There's actually a different priced uh, hired work. Well, there's that's the same picture. Wait, is this the Yeah, that's that's her name. That was her name. Uh Dejana Dittmer. Adam, no, what, man? Sure, something like that. 21 years old and nine months. Lend. Hmm. What does lend do, I wonder? Lend for 24, I don't know, I'm not sure what that is. 17 years, eight months. Nika Pullman. Franco fries. <laughs> there we go. We got Franco fries. Ooh, Franco fries is worth some money there. Yep. There's Reichenbach. Hmm. She's probably the cheapest. Might hire her next time. That that sounds like a little bit better price tag there if you ask me. One. Okay, you're back. We'll just, uh, is that cultivator on? I think that cultivator's on its side. You're right. Looking for a spot to uh, park this up here. Looks good to me. And that is still running yet. Okay. Now let's go sleep for like 100 days or something, everyone. We'll be back uh, next spring here, and uh, we'll start. Probably actually have to run down and pick up some seed first, but uh, let's go sleep. 100 days. How's that? What's that put us to? 1220. Uh, puts us to about Christmas time. Cool. We'll be back. And after a quick sleep, everyone, 200 days later, we're now the... Uh, 30th of March. Yeah, 30th of March there. I had to uh, double check that number there. So yeah, March uh, 30th there. 
Uh, okay, let's go ahead and disconnect that. We don't need that there at the moment. And as I suspect, Evan, our money did not go down. So, yes, the hired worker was uh, cost us money here the last uh, two years. It's uh, probably a good... I don't know. I guess it's a good thing we got rid of the hired worker. I don't know. Hard to say. Hard to say, right? But... Okay, so first things first. I'm going to probably need some seed. What have we not planted yet? We did... I think, did we plant all the... Other? We'll check the menu. I don't know if we did all the crops yet or not. I thought he was moving there, but nope. We're good. So own yield 14. Samurai. Let's see what's here. So we did barley. Or did we not do barley? We did... I think we did all the crops here so far. Other than corn. And we have not done corn yet. Of course, and of course, we haven't done grass. So spring wheat... What if we do spring wheat? We're nothing good on all the fertilizers there, that's for sure. And we might actually have... We'll, we'll see once what we got in storage. I mean, I'm not sure if we got wheat or what is in storage there. The rye seed will go ahead. Actually, we got quite a bit of rye seed. I wonder if we could just plant some more rye, I guess. It's a little hazy at the moment. Oh, there it is. There it is. I was going to say, isn't the spot we're supposed to unload? Uh, okay, rye seed unloading. Yeah, that's going to start unloading, right? Yep, that is unloading. Okay, now that we got that unloaded, let's go check and see what's what we got in the shed here. I think this is where we have to go, right? I wonder if we should back it. Maybe we should back it in. Find out. I'm not entirely sure where we have to be to reload the seed. I know we put some seed. Or no, is that fertilizer? Maybe that's fertilizer in here. Oh, what did we put in here again? I think it was seed. Definitely some fertilizer there. Backing up here yet. Field type is not supported. Barley seed. Yeah, there we go. We'll, uh... Uh, loading. I cannot start this. Unloading. Loading. Uh, max mountain tank. That was not supported. Hmm. Okay, well, I, th I thought we had some seed in here, but maybe, uh, unless, did we put the seed, maybe we got the seed, oh, wait, there's rye seed in it. What? Why is there rye seed in here? Where'd that come from? Okay, slightly confused, Jevin. Uh, it was unloading. I thought it unloaded. Okay, let's go back over here a minute. Uh, unloading. Start. Oh, is it full? Is that what we got going on? Oh, uh, okay. So, when it, you know, the progress was done. I mean, I, yeah, okay. Okay, never mind, everyone. I thought we were done alone. I never even checked the number down below. It was like, yep, we're, we're good. It's empty. Nope, it was, it was full. Okay, we'll be back in a minute here again. Okay, let's uh, let's try that here again. I mean, now that the cedar is empty, I uh, took another uh, full pallet there and a second pallet to complete. Well, actually, a third pallet, technically, right? Uh, to completely empty this uh, cedar here. Apparently, there's a 1,513 liters, I guess, is what each pallet holds over there. So it's not like just an infinite amount. I mean, you have to, like, yeah, it, it only holds so much per pallet. So that was rather interesting. I wasn't expecting that. Good to know, though. So you can't just uh, put an infinite amount of seed there or infinite amount of types. Uh, okay, let's try this here again. Looks like we got barley seed over here. So let's go with that if we can get this barley seed to load. Gene not in trigger. I thought we were in the trigger before, weren't we? I need to be over a little more. Kind of hard to see where we're uh, backing up, everyone, when this uh, screen's in the way. There we go. Okay, so we're still... 
Uh, fill type barley seed. Don't know even why it will not let us uh, fill here. Selected amount. Does a mountain tank 1,741 max amount? Well, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It looks like we got barley seed in. Let me, uh, what if we try to pull through here, maybe? Okay, apparently now we're stuck. Yeah, let's try pulling through once. See if that makes a difference. Actually, is there a way to uh, check this from the menu here? Let's see. That's vehicles. Animals. Uh, that is not the right one. Let's try that again here. Uh, employees. We'll probably come back to that here in a little bit. We might want an employee. Finances. Tank. Tank trader. Uh, so we got granular fertilizer, PK720. Yeah, we got barley seed. We got barley seed in farm grain storage one. Okay, so how does one get this out? Tell me fill type is not supported. I don't quite understand why. Why are we getting fill type is not supported here? I don't open. I don't know. We got barley seed in there. It's not letting us put it in. Do we have to, like, do something here? Hold out. Yeah, we probably don't want to do that spread rate. Lower support foot. Just this kite. Wow. Okay. Empty. Empty tank. Well, I think the tank is empty, right? Hold down. Yeah, we probably don't want that. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Loading. Collected amount. Because we have 1,741 in there. And then once we get to, uh, is this fill type not supported? Weird. I don't know, Ben. I don't know. Not sure. Okay, so fertilizer, mountain tank. I wonder if that's our problem when it's trying to fill... Oh, I bet that's our problem. It's trying to fill the fertilizer and not the seed. Well, how do we get it to uh, fill the seed then? Because I can't select the vehicle here, though, which is a little bit weird. Normally, I mean, it'll let you select the vehicle, but it's not letting me do that here in this case. Hmm. Well, then that might have to be a problem for another time here, because it is kind of time to wrap it up here for this episode. So on that note, you folks have any comments or questions, be sure to uh, leave them down below. And as always, thanks for watching, and until uh, next time.